Also happening today, the frantic search continues this morning for the 11 year old Massachusetts boy who police think might be in Connecticut. Crews will be gathering up first thing this morning in Enfield to search right along the Connecticut River. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Patricia Del Rio joins us now live at the digital desk. Patricia, why is the search now concentrated to Connecticut? Well, Connecticut State Police are stepping in and they will be scouring the river near the Connecticut line in Enfield to try and find him. And it's because Aiden, Aiden Blanchard is from Chicopee, Massachusetts, and that's where he went missing. And police have been searching the Connecticut River since he disappeared. Now they are looking down this way. Ever since Aiden Blanchard went missing February 5th, crews have been looking up and down the Connecticut River. He was last seen by a boat ramp near his home in Chicopee, Massachusetts. And after an extensive search of the river in Massachusetts up to the Connecticut border, Connecticut State Police are now getting involved. A state police boat will start looking in Enfield from the state line and work their way along the water to the Suffield Canal. Aiden was last seen wearing a red coat and black snow pants. The family is so desperate for answers, as of course you can understand. Aiden's mother will be there to observe, as well as his cousins who are from North Granby. Police will be using sonar equipment and they will start their search at 8.30 this morning at the Barnes Boat Launch on South River Street in Enfield. I'm Patricia Del Rio, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.